the grand finale. Paktoon up against the Warriors. It is the 29th match of the second season. Side and it was some wonderful striking. It certainly was. That was uh, Simmons getting going, pouring. And you thought, oh, here we go again. There's going to be another onslaught from the young lefty. And then that one again sneaks away. Oh, that was huge. That's out in that football stadium you talk about. One that was after the dead ball. And that crept over. Down the ground just. And they got off to a really good start. Ingram just couldn't quite get there. But the runs were flying from the outset. It's always crucial, particularly with that nervous energy, to get things going. And then the big fella, Powell, got himself absolutely humming. As Boren did go early, threading the needle. It was so much fun to be out there. Russell got out soon after Rummies and I started. It was an unusual dismissal, but he'd done a job. That was a shin breaker. Phenomenal hit. Oh, it was just an absolute blitzkrieg. Fireworks galore, and uh, so belligerent. Oh, gets a great platform and swings strong. So hard to stop Rodman Powell, and he was struggling out there, the skipper Darren Sammy, but he got hold of this one, and uh, in the end it allowed them to get up to 140 with that final delivery. So uh, Robin Singh, you know, he was the Kerala coach last time they, when they won it and uh, and he comes to Warriors and uh, produce such a good team who are, who are really up for it, up for the fight, lost the game earlier against these guys, the Pakhtuns and then took the revenge beautifully. Fletchy got going a little bit but the uh, good thing about the Warriors was they just kept taking wickets. They had the bowlers who could have really challenged them. There were some beautiful shots played today and uh, some uh, extraordinary strokes over extra cover, some good fielding. Overall, I thought it was a wonderful day and, uh, and a great T T10 final, beautifully taken. Some extraordinary catches we've seen. Yeah, there was. And it's almost like they saved their best to last with the catching. Because we have, of course, so the nature of the 12 days, you're going to see a lot of catches go down in the night sky. But we've seen some tremendous bowling, particularly from Hardis van Leeuwen, who for Wakar and I and our colleagues up here in the com box reckon that Bill Ewan should be the player of the tournament. Given this format now, it is dominated by batsmen. 18 wickets and 18 overs from Hardis van Leeuwen. As we check out these last rights, where Paktun simply ran out of deliveries to get close. Wahab showing off some catching skills. There's been plenty of it. Yeah, Ravi Bhopara, just uh, the one over for him tonight. And uh, end of the game, heading out. So Hale pops one over the fence. But uh, that's the end of it. Last shots of it, and look what it means to Darren Sammy and the Northern Warriors.